Well, Oli, was that a kick in the teeth at the end of, actually, a pretty decent performance? Second half was uh, we played some good football, uh, but we conceded three goals. It's from three shots on target. You can't when when you have three shots between the posts and you concede three. That's uh, disappointing, of course, because because we played some very very good stuff. Defensively, though, did you ever feel entirely comfortable with their threat, their pace, and behind? Uh, you, you always have uh, players like uh, Rich Allison, Calvert Lewin, running at you. you. You're never 100% comfortable, of course you're not. But I thought we played that. Played it uh, well after uh, they scored two quick goals in the, at the start of the second half. Then we uh, reacted well, created chances, to, uh, dominated possession. But then, uh, we, why it was the four minutes? That, that's uh, beyond me. But uh, compared to the three we had the other day, but all we have to do is uh, get the ball into the corner uh, and see it out, and we didn't. So what do you make of the goals conceded then? You've touched on it no, a little bit there. Poor goals, poor, uh, definitely. So when, of course, during a game you expect one or two uh, uh, good moments from the, uh, from the opponents. They had three shots that hit between the posts and you can see the goals. It's disappointing, of course, in the, when it's in the, la in the last minute in added time, uh, that's very disappointing. And I know no manager likes to come out and throw a player under the bus, but first goal, third goal, no, does David have to do better? I wouldn't uh, blame anyone on the goals, but we know that we could have uh, done better as a team to defend all of them. So what did you make today, particularly first half, with the way the two systems matched up? What problems did Everton give you, but also what opportunities with that diamond in midfield? Well, obviously, they, uh, they uh, tried to overload the midfield with Hammers in there with the, with the other three. Andre Charleston caused us a bit, bit of bother on the, on the counter-attack in the first half, uh, especially. But then we, we go into the half-time and 2-0 up. We didn't really deserve that because we didn't play well first half. We dilly-dallied too much. Two fantastic goals, definitely. Two great goals, but uh, uh, we had possession, but we didn't. Uh, it was too slow. Second half, I thought we, uh, as I said, after, the, after they scored two, we played some very, very good stuff. Uh, Scored a, uh, scored a goal from set play, which they don't really concede, uh, Everton. So that was uh, a good goal by uh, Scott. And then we should have should have seen it off. We should have scored uh, the fourth as well. Did you like the balance of your front four throughout the night, actually? I thought the front four uh, caused them problems and, and played well. Uh, I think uh, that wasn't a problem, of, of course. Uh, it's, it's a three-all game. It's a, it's a game with two good attacks and um, it's uh, probably many more uh, people out there that enjoyed watching the game than, uh, rather than the Man United supporters at the end. So is it one, though, when you look at the performance where you feel like the players should be able to pick themselves up quickly because the result isn't what you wanted, it's disappointing at the end, but the overarching performance, no, nothing wrong with it. But, it's, but as, as I've said so many times, uh, results, of course, they uh, create the mood. And uh, the last kick of the ball there, of course, that makes us go home really, really, really disappointed because we've lost two points just on a, on a long uh, thump up, the, up through the middle, which we should have defended better. But if you look overall performance, second half was good. But again, defensively, when you think about maybe winning a title, does it make you think, no, okay, we're, not we're still a bit short? <laughs> we're not talking about winning titles. We've come a long way, this team, and uh, we shouldn't be uh, even being considered uh, as title chasers. So that's more talk that, you, that you're... Uh, that's one for us. Yeah. That's one for you. We've got to be better as a team, and then let's see where we end up. And going forward, yeah, very good. We need to uh, stop conceding easy goals.